that terrifying ordeal. 400 prisoners were executed weekly during my imprisonment. And this is the evidence of a witness who gave evidence at position 62 in the commission, whose name has been redacted. Up to 400 prisoners were executed weekly during my imprisonment from November 1981 to February 1982. Please rise for the judges of the round Iran People's Tribunal is in part inspired by the Russell Tribunal of 1966, which looked into American war crimes in Vietnam. There is an estimate of 17,000 prisoners being killed in one year. Page 9 of the document and paragraph 25. In the dark summer of 1988, Prisoners in the go hart establishment communicated with each other in Morse code. By tapping on the cold walls of their cells, they spread the news of the arrival of the mysterious death commission. I still want to ask you about your time in this cell. Uh, particularly during the 1981 period, uh, when you were detained, did the cell have a window or vent in it? I had a window that was opened and opened. I had a window that was opened and opened. I had a window that was opened and opened. I had a window that was opened and opened. I had a window that was opened and opened. I had a window that was opened and opened. I had a window that was opened and opened. I had a window that was opened حواکش ما باید نگاه کنیم تو پارچه نکنار زدیم زدیم زیر پا هم دیگه بالا و توی چیز نگاه کردیم که من دو تا شکر عبدالرزا زن بودیم و آقای غلامزا غلامزا داده بود دو تا رو میشنام که اینا رو بسته بودن به درخت ها اینا رو هر دوست سنشون 15-16 ساله بودن و تعداد دیگه هم بودن که میبستن شد به درخت ها و اونجا رو بشن رو رقبار شدیم میکنم the efforts by uh, the Iranian government, as well as individuals in, in, uh, uh, sympathetic to the government, to deflect uh, particular investigations and particularly uh, deflect um, uh, results that they thought I should not reach because they were not based on complete information, in particular because they were not based on the view of the government of Iran. 75% of Iranians are under 30 years of age. They were born after the revolution. They have no idea that tens of thousands of people were executed. So this public awareness is the first step in creating a movement among the Iranian public that will demand justice and accountability. The most important valuable aspect of having this tribunal is for the facts to come out, for the international community to know what happened in Iran, what kind of crimes were committed by the Iranian state itself. And looking at this dark past is about building a bright future. We don't seek a vengeance, we seek justice. And if we cannot hold leaders accountable for these past crimes, then it will be very difficult to build a democratic future in Iran.